Hey everybody, I uh, I just found this really nice house. I just drove past it. Um, I'm in Turks and Caicos right now. And so I need somewhere to sleep. So I was gonna see if anybody was home. I'm just gonna knock real fast. Just kidding, motherfuckers, I live here. I live here. Welcome to my villa. I don't live here, but I'm staying here. Come in, come in, check it out. beauty that I get to experience while I'm here. I'm very fortunate, very grateful for this beautiful place that I am staying in with my sister and my team, the Summer Squad. We are here shooting content for all sorts of social media platforms. Without further ado, look at this place. Here's the living room. Parkour! Parkour! This is where we uh, hang out late nights and queue up content and edit. We all sit in a circle and we edit. And we also play Cards Against Humanity. The only cards that went are the sex cards. <laughs> <laughs> what makes life worth living? A racist boomerang. I lose every time because I guess I'm not funny. <laughs> Here is a dining room where we uh, just hang our socks out to dry. And we actually don't use this for anything other than Again, editing and content creation at the end of the day. Um, when we can, where we can, we stand or we sit here at the lovely bar. The kitchen is kind of a mess, but you know what? There's four chicks and two dudes in this house shooting content all day. No schedule, all right? Our parents are in here to tell us what to do, what to eat, so we got, we got Coke. I don't drink that. But we got coffee, we got sriracha. We ate some hot sauce the other night that burned our buttholes off, so that was awful. Um, this is it. This is it, this is where we um, sometimes eat. We don't really have much time to, but if we did, let's see, let's see what's in the, let's see what's in the little fridge over here. All right, four chicks and two dudes walk into a villa. They fill their fridge with a pineapple, strawberry, some fruit, three cartons of eggs for some reason, some Red Bull, some more Coke. But let's not forget, there's two huge bags of kale that we have not eaten, um, probably won't eat. Kombucha, of course. Sponsor me. They actually used to sponsor me. <laughs> they didn't sponsor me, they sent me free. Sent me free drinks and I drank them all the time. So, uh, health aid can just sponsor me. This is it. Leftover mac and cheese. That's a thing. That's a thing that we do here. So that's pretty much mutual live workspace. A lot of eating goes on in here. A lot of farting and burping. Now we're gonna go see my sister's room. This is the master bedroom. Now we're in the master bathroom. Look at this tub. I'm gonna get in so you can see the full effect of how beautiful and gorgeous it is. Cause now it's got me in it. Yeah. It's pretty epic. Like if this was my view every day, I wouldn't be mad about it. Here's where my sister gets ready and it takes her four hours for some reason. You have to check out this shower because not only do they have the, I don't know what this is called, like the rain shower or whatever. It's kind of like, no privacy, but this is my favorite part. Ah. So I'm assuming that this door was brilliantly put here because you will see soon there is private beach access. So if you're down at the beach, you got sandy feet, you don't want to track through the house, you just walk straight through here, you're in the shower. What? What? And now, where the magic happens, where Lacey uh, sleeps until noon every day, this is the bedroom. Lots of room for activities, such as and so forth as this and these things. So Lacey's out shooting right now, taking some epic pics for the gram. So what she doesn't know is that I'm home, jumping on her bed, wiping my dirty ass feet. Should I fart on her pillow, yes or no? But I'm gonna close her door so that she doesn't know I'm in there. Nothing is disturbed, except for the few extra grains of sand on her pillow. I'm just kidding. 
kidding. Now we're going to my room. Oh, hey, hey. Oh, you probably recognize this lovely bed and room from my other YouTube videos that I have shot and may or may not be uploaded yet. And if they're not, then they will be soon. But I did a bikini try on haul and an outfit, an island outfit try on haul. And this is my, I handcrafted this chair myself um, in 1994, the year I was born. I came out of my mother's womb and was ready for crafting. So this is great because this is where I take my poops and my peas. Um, this is where I do my makeup, and it's great because I have this like light, natural light coming in, sunlight, and my favorite part is this shower now because I just think it's really cool. I don't know. It's like all glass, see-through. This is my bathroom, you guys. Did you see that? See that? It's like, like you know, like I don't have a romantical partner, but if I did, this would be dope, because I could be like, hey, I see you, and you kind of see me, but it's all blurred out. Ooh. But <laughs> that's not happening, so. Gulp. So that's my room. And now we're going to Brian's room. Brian is our photographer. He's the best dude, best content. We take him all over the world with us. So this is, well, I feel a little room raidery right now. Like maybe I shouldn't be in the boys' room right now. So I think all the all the bedrooms are masters. There's what, four bedrooms. They're all masters. They all have their own like awesome shower and bed. And they're all kind of the same, but like just different light sources and all that. So. <gasps> Ryan was blessed with these awesome little egg chair things. So jungly. Ooh, what does a boy's bathroom look like? It looks absolutely the same as mine. Except for one sink. Wow, I got two sinks. Ooh, I'm special. Uh, yeah, it's the same thing. It's beautiful, but just like boy stuff in it. Ooh. Okay, now we're gonna go to the top floor and we're gonna go to, we have two of our girls from the summer squad are staying in the room upstairs. So we've been in Turkey Kinkos for a couple days now. I think it's been four days. We actually leave tomorrow, which I'm so sad about, but it's been an amazing trip. We've gotten to do some really incredible things. We went on a boat the other day. We went and saw a shipwreck. That was epic, so you're gonna have to see footage from that. I need deliverance If you want to come and set me free There's no forgiveness For the way you're touching me I've been waiting My body's aching Spark the lights on so now we are in the room of the girls who are coming along with us on our trip. And as you can see, they <laughs> have a lot of outfits out because they're professionals and they're just getting content. So we might see them around the house right now. But yeah, it's pretty much like all the other master bedrooms, like I said, they all have something unique about them. So this one just has its own little patio and beautiful view. We all get this incredible view. Um, it has the nice, you know, modest shower because obviously you can't show up all the goods here. So yeah, it's a great, another great bedroom. So here's their bathroom. And um, yeah, I have to mention one more time that obviously I got the best room, the best bathroom because <laughs> one puny little sink. <laughs> Losers. I don't have a window for when I take my poops. I want to look and see what the rest of the world is doing. What the heck? That's a good pooping toilet. And now I'm about to show you the best part of the whole thing is this gorgeous view and this patio that I've been bragging about. We've been chilling out here at night, getting content all out here, using the hell out of this pool. And most importantly, look at this, look at this view. So the house not only comes with all this incredible stuff that you've already seen it comes with paddle boards. It includes, and it, it, what? It includes an outdoor shower, of course. And there's like 
little flippers, little finny fins, little snorkel goggles, a whole gear, everything that we can use. Um, did I also say that we have like a housekeeper who comes every day for eight hours, that's his full-time job, is to come and just like basically clean up after us and it's he's been so wonderful and nice. Wow. Oh my goodness. What is this? It's a regular rum punch, no rum for now. No rum Delicious. For now. <laughs> thank you so much. Awesome. Hello, awesome. thank you. And um, he doesn't even mind when we come out here and we just kind of, you know, lay out, do our little, do our little woo woo thing. So something about Turks and Caicos is like, all the beaches are so beautiful and so clean. Most of the sand is like pure white or tan and it's not like dirty and gross and the water is so warm and perfect and just, excuse me, cause I gotta take a little dip. I take a little dippy dip. The most beautiful, wonderful things in life is like water and it's free to just like come out and stand in the water and it's awesome. So. All right, y'all, that was my first ever villa tour or any sort of walkthrough tour that I've done on my YouTube channel so far. So let me know, make sure you comment and let me know if you want to see more of these when I travel to different places, because you know that we're traveling all over. So if you want to see more villa tours or hotel tours or my house tour or anything like that, comment and let me know what you want to see. Thank you so much for watching. And on that note, we got a beautiful drone shot earlier. So I'm going to end it on that note. I want you guys to see the full effect of how beautiful this land is. So see you guys in the next video.